<laughs> um, we're here. I'm yeah. Kelsey. That's Lang. And no, vibes are on high. Yeah. Um, Everybody's ready to get going mm -hmm. for the season. <laughs> Every season, yeah. as you know, we sit down and say who's going to be the rookie of the year. So we did last week. And then we do every single postseason award. Today, we are doing the big guy. I personally think this is like the, the one, yeah. right? Like MVP, most valuable player. I have Lang two honorable mentions if you'd like to hear them, or we can just dive right into our top three. Well, yeah, I want to hear your honorable mentions. Okay, my honorable mentions. They might be my actual candidates. Oh my God, imagine. So Jason Tatum. Yeah. I don't think he's going to win MVP, but I think he's like, he'll, at the end of the season, he'll be like up in the discussions. Okay. Number two, this pains me to say because I think this human being is lovely. But Joel Embiid. Okay. I don't think I don't think it's his year again. I have an honorable, honorable mention too. Mm -hmm. uh, Nikola Jokic. Okay. All right. Who are your top three? <laughs> Number three for me is Nikola Jokic. All right. Uh, I personally think that he is one of the best. Not one. I think he's the best basketball player in the NBA in terms of like all around stats. Yeah. You know, like he can pass, he can he obviously can score, he doesn't can really rebound. Play defense, but doesn't really have to. Yeah, but MVPs are more offensive anyway. Yeah. That's my number 3. My number 3 is Kevin Durant. Oh my god. Because <laughs> he's kind of kind of been quiet the last few years and now they're got trying to build this super team in Phoenix mm -hmm. and it feels like it's time for a KD year. Okay. I don't hate that. Big KD year. I don't right. see it happening, but I don't hate that. Sure. Um okay, my number 2 now, this might be a little wah wah. Yeah. Luca. Luca is that. my number two. I just think he, I mean, this is what I hope for him. I hope he comes back after last year, after kind of having a bad taste in his mouth at the end of the season, and plays how I know that Luca can play. Do I think he has like that dog in him that like makes you like MVP ish? Like, no. Mm -hmm. But neither does Jokic, and like I, I think Luca's gonna have a really big year, and I think come the end of the season, a lot of people are gonna be like, "Oh my God, Luca." My number two is Joel Embiid, because I feel like once this Harden thing works itself out, and they get they move Harden, whatever, like Embiid's gonna be asked to play an even bigger role. Yeah with the Sixers team. And if they're good again, and you know, Nick Nurse system, maybe they're gonna be interesting good. Like, I, I, I don't know. I think Embiid's still gonna be in the mix. Okay. Look, I'm not against that. I like Joel Embiid. Okay, sure. Okay, my number one is Giannis. Like backtracking a little bit. Uh, well, you know. uh, Who's your number one? Giannis. Oh, I think he is going to have a absolute monster season. I think the Bucks are gonna be really, really, really good. And I don't like the freak time nickname. Oh, no, with. I don't yeah. like that at, at freak time in cream city. <laughs> don't like it. Don't like it one little bit. But I do think the Greek freak yeah. is going to have just I think honestly, he's going to have an incredible season. And he is mentioned again in a couple more awards that I have coming up in the next couple weeks. My uh, my number one is uh, one of your honorable mentions, Jason Tatum. Oh, my God. I was thinking about this. This is the first this. week of doing this with you for years, and I'm yeah. like. <gasps> I was thinking about this because I was thinking, like, all these guys, you hear about them working out in the summer, doing all these things. Mm -hmm. We didn't really hear much from Jason Tatum this summer, did we? Oh, he's been doing, like, the uh, work in the dark. The that zero dark 30 <laughs> type thing. Like, I don't, I don't know. Like, maybe he'll be great. Maybe he won't. But Maybe he's been partying with his new boo too much. They've got better players there now around him and good players. Like it's a good system. It's a second year with Joe Missoula, and it's like not as weird at the start of the season as last season was for the Celtics yeah. with everything they went through. So, like, I, I don't know. Maybe this is the year Tatum makes that leap. John Roser would be very happy, one of our coworkers. Does he have all his cards, too? Probably. Yeah. All right. I'm going Giannis. You're I'm going, going Tatum. Tatum. All right. Oh, my God. We never, like, really disagree on all of them. This time we did. This is crazy. All right, we'll see you next week for even more awards. We want to know who you guys have for your MVP prediction. It's very early. We know. Let us know in the comments. Awesome.